Now, Erica, this is the iridology chart, right? Yes. Iridology. Now, what is iridology? Iridology is the science and the art of determining the potential genetic risk factor of an individual and what may be the potential cause of that, those health risks and where they're located. It is not diagnostic. It is not a diagnostic tool. It is a preventive tool. When you go to the health, to a, your traditional health practitioner, doctor, or physician, they use diagnostic tools to find out what is wrong, what areas are weak, and so forth, and why. Getting an iridology explains to you your genetic potential risk. So you may not have that health challenge now, but it's the potential Before risk. Before you go on, I thought the iridology chart, here's the iridology, this is what it looks like, okay? It's your eyeball, okay? The point is that I thought you looked into my eyes and you did iridology. You look at my eyes, this is a yes. little thing on my eye, or your eye. I thought it was for diagnostics. I thought it was for diagnosis. I thought it was for, I look in your eye and you yes. got this problem. Yes. I was wrong. What it does is it allows me, based on certain markers, to let me know your constitution. Are you a type A individual or type B individual? It lets me know whether or not you're very resilient and you need to take certain breaks. I have, have had individuals that, based on their constitution, they were like the Ever Ready Battery Bunny and then in their senior years wonder why they have chronic and acute health challenges. And I'll explain to them, that's because you never took the time to get some rest and recharge your batteries and your bodies are now shutting down. Based on certain markers and where they're located, I can tell whether or not diabetes runs in the family, if it's a liver, hypertension, depression, I've been... Um, you looked at my eye, in my yeah. eye you, you found uh, colon. Yes. I mean, I mean a colon, not colon. Prostate. That's prostate. what it was, prostate. Mm -hmm. I had a grandfather who had prostate issues. That's right. Right. So you found that. Based on that. I have a potential to maybe have that issue. That's right. And so I don't be careful. I would recommend to you to always have a prostate examination. Yeah, but you know what? Uh, you know, we're talking about that. <laughs> I, when they put on that rubber glove, I get nervous. I'm serious. Most men do it. I, I mean, I'm not, you know, I'm not, you know, it's just, it's just, I mean, I'm like, do you have to do that? <laughs> Come on, man. But the, and the, all jokes aside, but you also looked at my, you already did iridology, yes. you look at my eyes, I should show you how it's done. And you, and I had an ear problem, but you mm -hmm. saw my ear, that's not a diagnosis? Because, you know, it was, it was a little line over here. Right. And I know I had like an ear infection exactly. or something. It wasn't there one time, and you saw this really rigid line in my eye. Exactly. We that's not a diagnosis. Be, we right? have to be careful and say okay. that it does not diagnose. What it does, it reveals, again, certain areas in the body that may have a health challenge. And I have to be careful because, you okay. know, certain words are owned by the AMA. You have to be careful saying that. You have this. to be careful as a holistic practitioner. Okay. There are certain words that we cannot use because the AMA owns those words. Wow. And so... The American Medical, Medical Association. Association. And yeah. so, therefore, that marker from your iris right. showed that that ear on the left side, of, right, on the mm -hmm. left side, right. needed some nutritional support. We needed to work on it, and based on the marker, and let me know what was that happening. And I went body. to the doctor, and they say it was like a little hole or something. They say it's going to heal up. Don't worry about it. Mm -hmm. So they, it was something wrong with the ear. And you know what it is? Because I put Q-tips in my ear. D, I dig Stop deep. Digging I, I dig deep, but yeah, and I perforated yeah. something in my ear yes. when I was digging in it. Then I, you know, in your ears. Okay. And then we also itch. talked about your lymphatic system, I think. I don't remember that. But what about my lymphatic system? That you need to exercise. Well, you can look at the me. Rebound. I don't need no iridology. I don't need an iridology. No, I need to exercise.